Welcome back to Living 808. The key to getting those beachy waves, well, there's only one person, well, maybe two for this segment of Dear Ponzi who can help us. I'm here with Crystal Ponzi Ponzi and one of the members of your glam squad. <laughs> Introduce <laughs> Jay Casito. Hey. How's it going, guys? He's my hidden secret. <laughs> not really here. hidden. He's all over Instagram. <laughs> and if I'm not working with him, he's actually working on my hair. So. And your hair <laughs> always looks fabulous. I know that's a question you get all the time. How do you get this look? Exactly. And everyone writes always, they want that beachy, wavy hair. And if you don't have Jake or you don't have me, it's We all easy. need a Jake. We can't all have a Jake. I know. I'm very blessed. And the fact that we were going to show you quick and easy okay. ways to do it. And you just need really key products, especially here in Hawaii, because you need to think about weather mm -hmm. and also quick and easy, meaning that, you know, quick and easy doesn't mean you have to buy a whole gamut of things. You just All need, right. you know, a, a few product, tools. few tools, a curling iron. We're going to tell you the difference between an actual curling iron, which most people have, and a hair wand, mm -hmm. which I absolutely love. It's easy Me to too. use, but you have to use it carefully. And hair products. So hairsprays and whatnot. But the secret that Jake has taught me is this product here. It's texture spray. And Jake is going to show you how to do your All beachy right. wave. I know. Well, so really earlier quick. today, I pre-sprayed um, Tanya's hair with the Oribe texture spray, mm -hmm. which honestly is my go-to product. Mm -hmm. It's one of the best texture sprays out there. Okay. Not only that it works and gives enough volume and that second day uh, feel, but also it works with our Hawaii humidity. And that's what I always try to teach a lot of my clients is finding the right product that works not only for you, but for where you're at. So this definitely works here in Hawaii. This is the key. Okay. This is the key. So you put that on. Do you let yeah. it dry? or exactly. uh, Let it dry. Mm -hmm. um, and then you go spray in. Spray it, it and go in there okay. and kind of just rough it in. Right. And there's really no right and wrong to creating yeah. this beachy texture um, wave. Because technically what you want to do is that perfectly imperfect look. With this curling iron, I like to really just kind of pass it through. Yeah. Clamp it in. Mm -hmm. And give it one pass and just kind of spring it all the way down. And you're That'll starting from you. the middle part. Yeah. So most people start their curl from the bottom, mm -hmm. which gives you that little curly cue look, mm -hmm. which, you know, and then ends up becoming at the bottom. So you want to start at the top, the mid, mid shaft of the hair. Mid section yep. right here. Uh, some people, it, I'm the one who cannot use a curling iron mm -hmm. to save my life, yeah. too. What's the key to doing it? Just practice? Uh, practice and also... Another key too, if you have one of these, um, don't be afraid to just also open it up mm -hmm. and wrap the Good. hair around oh, it. Oh, similar yes. to the wand. Yeah, similar to the wand. And then just hold it in for a few seconds and just let it drop. And again, you get that nice beachy, oh, easy see. way. Wow. Weave right over Wow, there. what an improvement. And then That's I like... think the, another trick too is like making sure like you go from underneath, going different directions. Mm -hmm. And then it's all about the hair wrap. So if you don't have, you know, this wrap, which I completely love, um, you can make your own. I think this is the reason why they made it because, you know, a <laughs> lot of people, there was too much to think about holding a curling iron and burning yourself. Right. But when you're wrapping, Oops, excuse me. But when you're wrapping the hair, making sure that you keep it in a way that you point down is the key. You're That's pointing the, the curling iron with the extension up and the rod down. Most people do it up and it gives you a whole different direction right. of your hair. Ooh, I'm liking this view of the hair. <laughs> and you know what? Uh, trade secret behind the scenes. You can tell I usually don't style the back of my hair <laughs> <laughs> from this angle. <laughs> that's okay. Me too. So, you know, and that, that's the reality of, you know, um, being so busy. But the beachy right. wave is great for a few days because the more you uh -huh. just fluff up your hair, you do the bend mm -hmm. and flip. You know, oh, you, do, do I get to do it? Do you yeah. get to do it? The bend and, and flip. flip. There and you go. Boom. You're right. like beachy, wavy, and ready, I'm ready to, go. to go to the beach. All right. Well, I think I'm going to head out to the beach. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Questions at dearponsi at khon2.com. Maybe we need to do a second about how to get Jake's style here too next time. <laughs> For the fellows, maybe Mikey could do something. Exactly. <laughs>